We know that stretching and range of motion are two key ingredients to improving your golf swing. So I'm going to show you some golf cart stretches you can do while you're waiting to tee off on the first tee or while you're out there on the golf course waiting to hit your, ne your next shot. The first one is for the quads and for the hip flexors. You're just going to hold on to the cart, reach down, grab onto a foot, keep your knee to knee, and just pull that heel into the buttock as far as you comfortably can so you feel that gentle pull right in through the front part of the thigh. Just hold that position for about 30 seconds or so. Now if you want to engage a little bit more of the hip flexor, what you can do while in this position is to pull that belly button into your spine and that's going to rotate that hip back a little bit and that's going to engage that hip flexor. Now if you have trouble grabbing onto your foot, utilize the cart. Maybe the handle on the cart or the fender on the cart. Just kind of support yourself, grab onto your leg, place it up on the handle. And if you don't feel that already, just kind of slowly sit back onto the heel till you feel that gentle stretch in through the quads. Again, the quads come up attached to that hip, to that hip bone, and that's going to help with that range of motion. For the upper body, we're going to do like a prayer stretch. We're going to stand to the side of the cart, keep your feet together, place the hands about shoulder width up on the cart roof. And then from this position, we're just going to nice and easy lower our shoulders down towards the ground till you feel a gentle pull in through the shoulders, upper back, chest area. Again, always to, to a gentle pull, never beyond, especially with this one, you don't want to put too much pressure on the shoulders. And just hold for about 30 seconds or so, breathing normally. That's a real good one. If you feel the muscles ease up a little bit, you just go a little bit further into the stretch. Alright, next, again for the lats and for the mid-back, T-spine area. I'm going to reach up, grab onto one of the supports in the cart. You can take your left hand with the palm in, right hand with the palm out. Get yourself close to the cart, and then nice and easy, let yourself just kind of fall away. And this is going to help stretch out, like I say, the lats in through here, that mid-back area. This is a real good one to kind of get ready for the golf swing. Breathe normally. Hold for about 15 to 20 to 30 seconds. And then we're going to turn it around and do the other side, do the opposite side. A fourth one you can do for the hamstrings. And again, you can utilize the cart for this. Just kind of put your foot up on the fender of the cart. All right, keep this back leg nice and straight. Keep this front leg nice and straight. You're just going to lean into the leg till you feel a gentle stretch. Try to keep that back nice and straight. You don't want to bow the back. Keep your chin up. You're going to feel that in through the back of the knee, up through the back of the thigh. So you feel a gentle pull. Breathe normally. Hold for about, again, 30 seconds or so. And if you feel the muscle ease up again, you go a little bit further into the stretch. And then you want to repeat that to the opposite leg as well. So there are four good stretches you can do while waiting to hit your next shot. That's going to isolate muscle groups that you're going to use while swinging the golf club. That's going to help your golf game.